Hey guys, and welcome back to Hard Edge. Anyway, uh, let's continue, shall we? We got the roulette ball, didn't we? Yeah, oh shit. Yeah, we got the roulette ball, so we need to go into the room opposite us. The games room. Excellent. I like a good games room myself. Now, let's go see what's going to be in the secret exit of ours, eh? Ah, the music. The music. Let's switch over to that so we don't accidentally use anything. Uh, I guess we're going to use the roulette ball. Probably not for gambling, though. Lucky number seven, eh? Who'd have thunk it? Right, let's go see if we can get our disc back. An old fashioned booty. Yeah. Oh, come on. Right. Let's go through the door and see what magic. Oh, ooh. I was going to say, see what magic awaits us out here. Interesting. Oh, hey. A couple of goons to deal with. Apparently, this goon knows how to kick an ass or two. Most likely due to the fact that we can't aim at him properly. But hey, it's all good. It's all gravy, baby. Why can't I pick that up? There we go. Alright, let's get a little bit closer. Back the hell away from that. Game has some very questionable enemy designs, that's for sure. I mean, they go from interesting to strange to downright useless. Right. Go have a little peek around in. Oh, hey guys. Um, let's get the hell away from these guys. Oh, we can't because we're stuck on him, apparently. This is going rather badly. Any gen. Oh! The gentleman decided to replenish our health for us. Pretty good of him. Ah, uh, where are we? Oh. Okay. Where does this lead? Ooh. Some kind of barrier. Shutter. Hmm. We'll have to blast it out of the way. <clears throat> okay. We're gonna need some kind of heavy duty now, explosives. We just had a bomb. Yeah, if only. I'm guessing you don't have a bomb anywhere in that spandex suit of yours. Uh she's got very much um an interesting outfit on to say the least. It's what well, oh look at her body proportion as well almost as silly as uh, Burns. She's like 80% leg. Yeah, she's actually, you know, 80% something else, but we're not going to go there. But yeah, her shoulder pads are weird. They apparently light up, which, you know, wouldn't be the greatest Special Forces outfit. Kind of give you away. Right, alright. <sighs> Looks like we're going to head back. So we can go up to the roof. Oh, hey. Hi. I guess these guys respawn. Never know. Might be able to get some health out of them. Nope. Oh, buddy. Come on. You and me, bro. You and me. Let's have a knife fight. Oh, looks like he's got a bit of Parkinson's or something. Yeah, he's definitely having mental problems. Bless him. Let's put him out of his misery. There you go, dude. Yep. Nothing. Michelle's getting a bit of mental deficiency as well by the look of things. Okay, so we're on the roof of this building. Ooh, I guess we can go in there. 
Even during an incident like this, the night sky is as calm as ever. Yeah, well, I'm sure it is. Right, let's sneak in here anyway. It's very cramped in there. Rachel might be able to push herself in. Oh, no. I don't want to play as Rachel. Rachel sucks. And not in the good sense. Ugh. Fine. Go on. We shall enter the ventilation duct. Because we have no choice. There's plenty of room in there. Yeah, she definitely looks like a robot. So, where does that put us now? Research Lab B. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Ah, oh, we've got monsters over there. That's not... Oh, hello. What's this? There's a switch. Press it? Uh, I guess. What the hell is that? Some kind of strange machine. Um, where did he come from? Well, we've got all we need here to make a bomb powerful enough, you know. Okay. You do? It takes some time to complete. Come back in a little while. It, uh, that's cryptic. How did you get through the vent? I was told that I had to play as Rachel. Because nobody else could get through there because they're too large. And next thing I... Oh dear. Uh, this is awkward. Uh, oh shh. Right. Oh god, this is gonna be questionable. Okay. Okay. Oh, right. I mean, that was kind of easy, wasn't it? Now, Alex is injured. Hey, Alex. There you go, buddy. Have some health. So, I guess when... Oh, shit. I guess uh, they were lying when they said nobody else could fit inside. There's a lever. Toggle. Sure. Ah. Where does that go? Right, how long's he gonna be? It's not quite ready yet. Just give me a little more time. All right, dude. I guess. I guess we have no choice. We're gonna. Give him a little more time. Whilst we get off and shoot some stuff, I suppose. Go oh, we're going down. Okay. Where are we going down? Where the no enemies, I guess. Ooh, ah, we're in the opposite side. Okay. Right, do we have any goodies to find? Found a disengagement manual. This is heavier than I thought. I'll just take what I need. Okay. Oh, geez, that is uh, what you call a uh, wall of text. Disengaging the electrification array. The electrified area serves as a preventative measure against unauthorized entry. Disengagement requires a key device for this purpose called the disengagement device. We have that, I think. There are a total... Oh, there are a total of three disengagement devices. And disengagement cannot proceed without all three in the interest of security. The storage location of the keys has been distributed amongst multiple floors. Care should be taken to ensure that the disengagement not be performed without proper authorization for non-emergency purposes. Um, okay. There's three keys. Ugh. That's not great. Right, okay. That leads us back here. 
let's fully search this room out first though. So we need three keys, damn. Oh god. Okay. There's a file and a couple of discs. They don't particularly look that important, okay. Oh, we're not going to worry about those then, are we? Looks like we found the discharge management system. There are three slots. Uh, yeah, but we've only got one there. Use disengagement device one. To stop the discharge, you need... Yeah, 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 we know. There's a fairly large file. Yeah. Is there really nothing else in this room at all? Seriously? Okay. You would have thought there would have been something stashed around here somewhere, but apart from the fact we're getting stuck on the everything. Uh, okay, cool. Well, um, let's get out of here, I guess. I can find the door. Okay, so what's this way then? Instructions for incinerator use. Combustion is turned on and off and flame intensity is regulated by means of four separate control valves, of course it is, which are turned in a spe uh, specified order. The sign posted underneath reads, problem is currently being corrected. Each value, uh, each valve, value? Now stays open or closed for a short period of time. Appropriate caution should be taken. Oh, goody. Goody gumdrops. Burns could probably push this. Yeah, he probably could. However, we don't have Burns. Um, right, okay. Uh, so, uh, I guess there isn't really much else. Oh! Found a vault key. That's useful. Is that it? Vault key. Interesting. Um, right. I guess that's all we can do now. Climb the ladder, sure. Uh, I guess we're gonna go talk to Burn, see if he's finished. I don't know where we could use a vault key. How's it going, buddy? What's the very slowly kicks into action? And here it is. Hey. Order made Burns bomb with anchovies and extra cheese. Could have done without the anchovies and extra cheese. Blast through that baby like a knife through butter. <laughs> <laughs> All right, settle down there, dude. Uh, did you did you really have to put anchovies and extra cheese on it? Definitely looks like there's extra cheese on it. Uh, Byford's bomb. Okay. Well, so we can open that up. But what might be a good idea for now... Let's go down here. And let's shift that bloody... box out of the way. So at least that opens up another area then, doesn't it? Wow. Well, at least another shortcut, I guess. Oh, Burns. He looks psychotic, man. Uh, yeah. Took a while, but we can actually fit down there. Right, so we now have another area. That is... Uh, uh, do we want to do anything down here? So we still don't have the disengagement key, or enough disengagement keys, I guess, uh, I guess we're just going to go blow the door, um, yeah, because I'm guessing there's nothing we can do in here yet, is there? Oh, hi. 
No, this is still the same old shit going on in here. Yeah, explosives and everything. Yeah, we we know we can control the discharge. But, not yet. Right, cool. Alright, let's go back. Ooh, yeah. Let's go back through the other door. Really don't want to fight that thing. Um, wait. Ah. Oh. Yeah, that thing wasn't here a minute ago, was it? Can we... Ah, okay. Right. Well, we can actually just destroy this thing. Yeah, this thing wasn't here before. Luckily... doesn't to appear to be as strong. Yeah, this thing is nowhere near as strong as the one we had to fight earlier. Which is good. Well, I'm not sure if it's even worth fighting. Probably not going to get anything from fighting it. The pincers don't seem to do any damage to us. Or it might be that we're just too close to it. But that doesn't make any sense. Because the other one was doing damage to us. Like, all it had to do was touch our character model. Right, well, okay. Ooh, health too. Very nice. Um, I guess we're going to go... Blow the door up. Wait, hang on. Unless we can't. Climb ladder, yes. Is it going to give us a ah? Uh, they're going to give us a silly reason why we can't leave here or something. It's oh yes, yes it is. So we do have to go down this way. Ah, uh, of course we do. I mean, what did I expect? So I guess that wasn't an optional path to open, we just had to open it, because... Because screw you, that's why. Okay. Yeah, yeah, come on, there we go. Right, okay, so in that case, where the hell... We have got... Oh, we got a vault key, didn't we? Ah, where was... Office... So... Where was there a vault? Let's get back up to here, I guess. Ah, right, yeah, we need to go right around the houses, don't we? Research lab. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. So we just need to go all the way back down to that. Oh, no, we can just go to any elevator now, can't we? Yeah, all right, let's go. As a robot dude. Oh god. Damn it. We really don't care about yeah, fighting everything, but I guess this thing made his bed. Now he will lay in it. With his broken and burnt bones. The robots have bones. They do now. Oh, those things. Yes. Let's see if we can just jimmy. Oh, right. Okay. It stun locks you. Cool. Can we destroy it? We can. Oh, hey, everything. Let's destroy that. I don't actually need to destroy anything else. Now let's go back to the floor, 
27. floor above us. Shame we can't just go straight to floor 28. Uh, that would be a lot more convenient. Ah, yeah. Well, okay. Well, that sucked. Now, I'm wondering. Here we go. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Nothing. Seriously. Absolutely nothing. I like the way it shouts warning at you when it's about to do some damage to you. Anything? Ooh, that was a big health pack. Don't mind if I do. Right, let's keep going. Wait a minute. Ah. No, it w yes, it was through there, wasn't it? See, I do remember my way around this map. This map is reasonably small. It's not too bad. Okay, let's give the game an actual hard save. A yeez. I guess whilst we're here. Save state as well. Because why not? Ah, uh, now. This is where we fought that bitch. Yeah, man, get up there. Ain't nobody got time for you to take six hours to climb two steps. Right, what was in here then? Yeah. To actually switch to somebody else. Somebody else that can actually move. Right, that's better. Okay. Ooh, I guess that's the vault. Found a black EX bottle. Um, okay. How much is in a EX bottle? Ooh, 100 health. Ooh, who do you want to give that to? Definitely not Rachel. 100 health, that's a lot. Possibly Burns. Might give it to him. Hmm, Michelle? Am I going to regret this? Probably. Yeah, that's a lot of health. Okay. Alright, and now do we have anything else here? She's got a lot of health now. Lights from the city. Well, I guess, where else would they be from, to be fair? Lights from the city. Anything at the globe? It's a globe. Yeah. I, I, yeah. Okay. It's an exceptionally large desk. Must have been used by a director. I guess so. Okay. All right. Well, let's go check around the other side. Found a first aid tube. Oh, that's nice. Oh. That's it, though. Is that really all that's here? Okay, I guess I guess that's all that's here. Right, let's go blow that uh, barrier, then, I suppose. Oh, we don't have to go here at all, do we? I guess all that stuff we just picked up, that EX bottle, that was just a bonus. Uh, how do we get back out? Come on, Michelle, I expected more of you. You shouldn't be that slow. Um, hmm. Right, of course it was through the games room. Of course it was. I knew that. I was just testing you guys. Yes, that'll do. Well, we have well and truly gone around the houses to get that bomb. 
This is it. I remember. Well, Michelle, that was pathetic. Congratulations. Oh, we just like cut his neck as he got up. Beautiful. Really? Nothing? Gave us nothing? Alright, well, let's go cut this guy's gizzard out. Oh, come on. There you go. At least give the lady a health pack. No? Dick. Wait, are we in the right area? Yes. Right, let's go check this explosive concoction we've made. I guess we're going to set the bomb. Seems like the right thing okay. to do. You come over here. <laughs> but she's a robot. I'm sure, she would have been fine. All right. See that, everyone? It is. Uh, the excitement of youth. Wow. Yeah. That's that's open. Okay. Ooh. Ah, uh, no, not another one of these things. Oh, that's okay. Let's exercise the knife. Wow, that dude's got a lot of health. Is it me or are their health bars getting bigger? Kind of hard to tell. Anything for the lady? Nope. Nothing. Right, what are we looking at here? I've got a couple of doors to choose from. Let's go through this one first. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, that guy's got a pretty burly health bar. Almost certain back at the start of the game. They had enough. Ow, that hurt. I really should have paid a little bit more attention to that bomb. That's fine. Hopefully some of these guys can give us some health. Really? Son of a... Right, let's get rid of that bomb. Um, Anything in here? Ooh. A valve handle? What is this? Sorry, a power handle. What is this? Resident Evil? Looks like a half-finished machine. Well, it's definitely going to be a half-finished machine now. Um, right. So, what have we got here? Parts from machines. Yeah, that's cool, but have we got anything good? There's something inside. Ooh. Diary of a maintenance division. Diary of a maintenance division staff. Okay. Month. November. Date 13th. I've made a terrible mistake. I think I accidentally threw the disengagement plug in the trash. Oh dear. If this gets out in the division, I'll be fired. What will happen to my wife and kids? I'll have to find that plug somehow. The garbage incinerator, oh good, is in the basement of the building. The underground level is listed as a classified area and so is off limits to us. It won't be easy for someone uh, from another department to get an entry permit, but I've got to find some way in. If the disengagement plug is anywhere, it has to be in the incineration area. I'm planning to go tomorrow night. I've managed to get down to the basement, which is built like an elaborate trap. On top of that, I saw some guys down there who didn't look as if they, uh, as though they worked for the company. All dressed in military gear. Who the hell are they? I gave up midway on their account. But I have got to get to the incineration area tomorrow night. I'll go down through a trash chute. Okay. Uh, sounds like a reasonable idea. Oh, nice. First aid kit. Nice. Well, we don't want to waste that first aid kit. Uh, 
first aid tube. Wait. Finding some good stuff. Uh, anything else? Parts for machines. Right, well, that looks like it. Ah, we're on half an hour here, guys. Right, so. Progress. I guess when we're going to come... Well, when we come back, we've got another door to explore here. And we've apparently got to get to the incineration area. That's going to be fun. Oh, boy. So, till then, guys. Thanks for watching.